Good afternoon, I'm Jeff. I'm a Sewer Tech Northwest. Today we're at property address 3801 C Street here in Washougal. We're located at the left side of the home right next to the uh, deck stairs. We've got a 4 inch ABS clean out. This will be the point of access. <clears throat> I'm going to insert the camera and check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer line. Currently have water running. Here we go. It looks like it transitions here at about three feet out. Uh, appears to be cast iron. I'll verify that here when we go a little further. Uh, but you can see we do have a, a pretty good sized root intrusion through that joint. I'm turning the water off here so I have a little bit better look at things, but it looks like um, it does a hard 90 right here and starts dropping in, and I believe that right here we've reached the uh, septic tank. That's why when I kept going down deeper, you're just seeing more and more water as we go. So we're going to shut the water off. That way we'll have a little bit better idea of what's going on here. Um, I am going to mark this spot right here for a uh, repair to correct the root intrusion. Is, uh, that stuff is going to start. You can see how it's snagging, like grease and stuff is building up on, in parts of it. As that continues to grow, it's going to grow across the flow line more and more and cause more debris to build up in those spots. And it looks like I see the tank lid here right behind me underneath a, uh, <clears throat> a bunch of 2x4s. Looks like someone made a lid for it. It looks like the line here is uh, quite short. Uh, because there's root intrusion here at the joint, we'll see what we can see once it's all drained out. Um, but I would recommend having the tank inspected to make sure there's no issues with that as well. It does appear that we hit a tank here, and then uh, from that point, I'm not sure if it goes out to the street. Some Washougal homes do, more of the newer ones that I've seen. Uh, this may have a drain field. I would uh, check records and look into that to see what kind of uh, setup you have. Alrighty, I located the camera head, and uh, it's just before the, uh, again, that wooden lid here that looks like it's over the top of the, the tank, I recommend a repair to correct the root intrusion we have here, and I also recommend inspecting the tank. Um, as I drop into here, it looks like I can pause, it looks like there's little strands visible right underneath the water, so there may be root intrusion inside the, uh, the septic tank there as well, and I would recommend uh, check it out and see what type of uh, tank system this has it whether if it goes all the way out to the street after that or drains into a field or something of that nature i'm in the reverse direction here go back towards the house a little bit just inside the foundation and at this point we're uh we're about eight nine feet inside the uh, crawl space at this point so that pipe coming right out of the house there looks good. Uh, so I would recommend a, uh, just a fix to correct the root intrusion and uh, get some of that debris and stuff cleaned out of the, the line there just after the roots. The line's kind of gunked up. I'd replace that last little uh, one, two feet of pipe. But uh, because those roots are in the, in the uh, joint there and it looks like there might be roots underneath the water in that tank as well, uh, I would recommend getting that tank inspected and possibly pumped as well.